what's happened, Carl? I've got tired. Right, we made it to the hospital. But what's happened, Carl? Screw it, another puncher in the back wheel now. Uh, right, yeah. Uh, basically, what we've got to do here is park up and basically jump out in this car park and hit this bunker that we're going to now. Uh, there are people there, so it is. Uh, they can see you getting in it. We will need to get in before anyone comes, basically. And it's quite a busy area. Six pound for adults. Uh, somehow, I think we're going over the wall, like Carl said. Glad we didn't pay six pounds getting here. Are you glad, Carl? Oh, definitely. We don't pay. No. <laughs> we just climb over the wall. Exactly. <laughs> You know how the uh, urbexes do it. Yeah. yeah, do you reckon if we ask for our money back, they'll give it us? Yeah. No refunds to take it. Right, so what we've got planned today? Well, you'll have to watch a video, won't you? We're going to see Carl, and we'll go to see Richie Wellick. He's not been well recently, he's been in an hospital, so me and Carl are going to visit him. So, yeah, uh, stay tuned. Also, we might be going underground. So yeah, let's get a move on. He's going through Stockport now. Yeah, right, yeah, we've gone and got him now. We're going to go and see Richie Wellock. Uh, he's back from his holidays now, Carl. So, how was your holidays? Where did you go? I went to Cosy Greece for seven nights. It was fantastic, beautiful weather. Apart from getting bit all over by mosquitoes and coming back on the plane getting a cold. Yeah, it was, uh, everything was all right. Hence, you're wearing your face mask. Yeah, yeah. I don't want you catching anything. Good, good. It is <laughs> <laughs> yeah, keep your face nappy on. Yeah. <laughs> All right. See you soon. Uh, what's happened, Carl? I've got a flat tire. A flat tire. Uh, pumping it up as we speak. So yeah, it's not going great, is it, at the moment? But stay with us. We'll get there. So like you see, we're back on the road. Right, we made it to the hospital. But what's happened, Carl? Can screw it another puncher in the back wheel now. Ah, oh, bleeding hell. What are the chances of that? Yeah. Oh, we at least we got here. We'll go and see Richard in a second now. Who uh, is the man himself? Uh, yeah, right, Richie. They don't think I'm ill now, they just think I'm old. That's what it is. Tell you what, you... Like a racing horse at the moment, going so fast. <laughs> yeah, it's great to see you. <sighs> there you go. Yeah. Well, yeah, they, they, they say now that I'm not ill, I, I'm just old. That's why I need this. That's good news. How are you doing? <laughs> I'm doing great, mate. Doing great. Yeah. Are you just washing me up? Yeah. And there's wife. <laughs> oh, stayed on camera today. Oh, I've got two words so special. Oh, I've got your Oh, the traditional. I just look like great. And they are very traditional for um, being. Yeah, I've got you. That's mine, actually. Right, big one. I've got these for mine. Oh, some poor magazine. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> They're not new, but oh, right. I thought it, yeah, keep it on the phone. So, so, no, really do appreciate that, Carl. Thank yeah. you very much. Oh, you're welcome. So, Richie, what, what brought it on, do you know? So, it's, it's an undetermined um, infection which has happened to me. 
uh, which has brought on reactive rheumatoid arthritis. Um, they also said it was chlamydia as well, so uh, maybe they've been banging around a little bit too much. But uh, yeah, so um, but they've also said maybe I'm just old and I, this is this is how it's going to get from now on. Actually, uh, I think they're right. Actually, and how long was you in your bed for? Four weeks. It was four weeks of having someone wiping my ass. <laughs> this is really great. And, and having to feed me. Um, but they, they've stopped doing that now. But they've said uh, you can walk now so you can wipe your own ass. So oh, that's not good, is it? I know. Is that a painting they've done of you? In the frame? Simmer. Yeah, yeah, that, that, that was me. A painting <laughs> in the <laughs> simmer frame. Yeah, you're right. I've forgotten they've done that. Yeah. It, 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 it's a dementia. It, 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 I've forgotten about that one. Yeah. Cheers, Carl. Is that the same frame? Dude, it's the same time. Yeah. <laughs> They've caught it well, haven't they? Yeah. 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 Good old so grapes. Have you been in this unit a couple of days? Um, just like in a week now. Right. right. So, um, and um, I am planning a breakout. <laughs> <laughs> Is that how you no, I, 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 no already, I believe so, yeah. I, I've already done something which they, they were like furious about. Yeah. Uh, so there's like a cow field over there. And I was uh, like, okay. I know this sounds weird, but there's an actual cow field over there. And I went, I went into the cow field because you can open the double doors from um, the uh, old fogies home which I'm in. And honestly, it is actually like an old fogies home. Um, and uh, I walked around and I walked all the way around. Like, and I went from, past the service area, and there's like a little catch, and I came out of there. I'm like, I'm out, I'm out. <laughs> because usually, you usually have to go through all these locked doors, and there's like airlocks and everything. Mm. And I'm like, I found a way of getting out without having to go through all these security measures. So, yeah, I would thought is there any underground access? Apparently, there is a massive big tunnel yeah. from where the old hospital used to be. Yeah. And it was too expensive to actually fill it in. And they had all the services running in it. So apparently, there's a, a 200 metre tunnel that is just still there. Oh. So, but that of getting out, um, I'm going home for my son's birthday on Monday. So, um, yeah. So, well, that's a big secret, isn't it? Well, it, 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 <coughs> it, it, it would have been big secret if they hadn't actually allowed me to go out. They, they have actually said, we will allow you because oh, we know cool. that you're going to actually break out anyway. <laughs> <laughs> so, I've got a six hour reprieve from being here. How old are you going to be? So, he's going to be 11. Yeah. So, and it's perfect for him because Monday, He's on um, his teachers on um, a um, day strike or something. Training day. Oh. And they've just been on a week's holiday for the children, but obviously they can't do a training day on in, in the holidays, oh, can they? So, yeah. all right. <laughs> Nothing to do with what's up. Because it was my birthday. I was like, oh, I'll, um, I'll, I'll, I'll do a smoking. Anyway. Went to work and I was like, oh, it's really painful, I'm going to piss. This is a bit weird. And it was a painful, so I've had a piss. This is a bit weird. So I was like, don't really care about it, it's fine. It might go soon. You know, it might go soon. Yeah. So Wednesday, yeah, still the same. But now, uh, I've not had a great night's sleep, but I've had like red eyes, like demon eyes. Anyway, so so Thursday comes and I'm like, this is really painful. Right, Friday I finish work early. I go to the doctors and uh, went to the doctors and just like, oh, would well, you like to take a specimen from me? So, All right, there you go. And it looked like clay water I'd given them rather than piss. Like, yeah, you've got a really bad infection. So. Um, so if you get like clay looking like this, yeah, it's uh, yeah. it's not good. When's the next time you went exploring? 
a week prior. Oh, well, yeah. What sort of stuff did you do? I went into dirty, mingy, mingy water. Um, but you don't care much about that. So, um, could it have been off that then? Really? It could have, but. Splashing about. But I've been in that mine about 10 times before. Oh, right. It's a mine which I'm always after this guy, William, to go with me. Don't do it. But, <laughs> but he'd always turn me down. Well, that's it for me and my name's Lord. All gone now. So, um, but uh, yeah, I've tried getting Will in there so many times. In fact, once I got him to the doors and he'd welded it shut. Oh. So, yeah. And you was up for doing it? And yeah, still I'm up for doing it though. Yeah, well, you have to do that with Antonio because um, my days of um, mine exploring, for the sake of my family and me, I've, 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 I've had to go for it now. So that's how it all started. Yeah, the last one I did was a car cave, I think, wasn't it? Was that the last one we did? Car cave? Car cave? No. No? Did we do some after that? Yeah, I've done loads of explorers after that. I just remember that being the main one, the car cave. When, when, when did you do that one? Years ago. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. I was going to say that was years ago, I thought. Yeah. Yeah. I can't remember if there is more caves after that. I think the last one I did with you, Carl, was that mill, Leak Mill. Oh, you're on about explorers in general. Oh, right, sorry. Oh, you're just, just going out mines and caves, yeah. right? Yeah, that's right. I went past that, right? Yeah. Yeah, I went past that. Yeah, yeah. So the others like, well, that way. Yeah. Still blowing out like that. Yeah. It, yeah. It, it was, it was a... Uh, dodgy, it, that milk. Oh, yeah. dodgy. Well, really it went up so far, didn't we? Yeah. yeah. Well, no, we, we went to the top so, layer. Yeah, but we looked at the floors. We looked at the floors and they're like that. It looked like... An inch gap. Crack one yeah, yeah, all the way through the stairs. It looked like it was balsa wood, yeah. and we saw there was like places where there's must big holes. And I'm like, if we stand on that and we go through, yeah. and if it's bad underneath, and then we go through that one and go through that oh, one. Gosh. But I don't know if you saw my video on it. If you look, we can see before we go in. You know, on the downstairs, and there's a um, like a pillar which is kind of pulling down yeah and you see it when after when we've come down and we heard a big bang we also were in there didn't we and i'm like that of maybe it was that if you haven't got a parking space make room for yourself <laughs> by moving bollards out of the way <laughs> oh bless him <laughs> oh do you know what i bet shall, shall i ask him if he wants to borrow my zimmer frame <laughs> Brilliant. Well, he's saying, <laughs> well, if there's a space there, I'm having it. Look at him. him. Look at him. Lifting it. I couldn't do that. Look at that. Oh. Yeah, yeah, there's another one. <laughs> Is that a Karen? No, we've been told off. It's a Karen. No, that's not good, Karen. Ah, he's been caught. He's been rumbling for it against that curve up there, didn't she? Yeah. Why she I don't know. Keep doing anything different. Is it? Sorry about that. Uh, anyway, she's stopping the conversation. Anyway, I'm, 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 I'm done with my description of. Um, my, my, my piss and everything else. <laughs> uh, right, see you later, Richie. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Take care. Enjoy your bed. We'll uh, go out and have fun. <laughs> All the best, mate. <laughs> yeah, right. Um, me and uh, Carl have left uh, Richie now, and we're off now to see if we can get us underground somewhere hopefully we'll get no more punches and things don't go too bad so hopefully it'll be a decent uh, place where we go next so stay tuned for that right yeah uh, basically what we've got to do here is 
park up and basically jump out in this car park and hit this bunker that we're going to now uh, there are people there so it is uh, they can see you getting in it we will need to get in before anyone comes basically and it's quite a busy area uh, one it's a fireworks night bonfire night and two it's in a pub so yeah a bunker in a pub so we've got to be quick on this one yeah, you're not wrong. Right, here we are, look how busy it is. Uh, come on mate, you need to go across. Yes, come on. Yeah, look how busy it is. Uh, it's a little bit of a busy car park. And there's the bunker, right in front. So what we'll do, we we'll go down the side of this van here. Oh, we can't, there's a car there. Right, okay, right there. There, right, can't open the lid. Yeah. Going down quick. Is that filming? It was when I started it. Yeah. It's a bit wet this one. Been waiting a couple of years to get down this one. It does start to smell a bit moldy. You got your old bed there, where the salt used to be. So that's pretty cool. Then you go in here, the main room. It's flooded, so like you see. You got the one petrol can there. You've got another one there and another one there. Uh, another petrol can there. So four petrol cans. That's where your electrics are. You still see the wood where you have all the wires going across. Oh, that's cool. You've got the original timer there. So that's excellent. So you've got your pump there to pump out the water. Uh, you've got an old bench and the uh, original door that used to be up there. So that's pretty cool. I've been waiting for about two years for this to open back up. I came down last week, seeing the hatch was open, but I didn't have any wellies. I have now, so I came back and got out to film it. And we're going out now, back out there. Here we go. And after this, uh, there's a fireworks show going on. So I'm out head there. Let's see if we get collared now. Was it come out? <laughs> no, nope. all right, hey, Cal. It's not a bad place, isn't it, to have an arrow people? Slide it across. Sorted. So that's one arrow see post. Let's go and see some fireworks. Yeah, we did that bunker. Look at all the cars here, there's loads of them. At least it's a uh, busy and no one came out while we were trying to uh, do this bunker. So we're at the Hair and Hounds in Hyde. There's Carl there. Uh. Hello, Ricky Atten. <laughs> <laughs> so let's go on to the Cricket Club now. Right, you can see it there. We've got the bonfire. 
So let's go in and see what's going on. Yeah, you got to pay how. So yeah. Have a quick look. There you go. Hey, keep going. Six pound for adults. Uh, somehow, I think we're going over the wall, like Carl said. So let's go and sneak in. It's a challenge right now. I don't know. But what will we do? Walk past here, get right down into the corner. <laughs> Wait, start. Can you write for it, Carl? I don't know, if you want, but I, I just want to get What can you say? What can you say? Get out. Yeah, say get out. Right, we'll see. <laughs> right, I'm going over here. Yeah, hold that. You come in. Come to have a look at the fireworks and fire, bonfire. Right. Join in. Right, I'll go and have a look. See what we'll get to it or not. Oh, he has came in. He came in. <laughs> no, it's too many trees there. You have to come round. Alright, straight down to the, down. We've got someone in the field there. Ah! How'd you work flying then? Trip over a branch. There's a fire. Yeah. I don't know. We're in now anyway. At least we didn't pay six coins. This is just standing in the field. Yeah. Shall we have a walk through the club as well? Well, we don't pay. Not like a bit of cheek as well.
So yeah. There's a clubhouse over there. The bonfire is over there. <coughs> don't know. Yeah, I don't know when the fireworks go in and go off. Oh, ah, yeah, you can see him loading the fireworks up there. Along with the headlight. Sorry about the wind. Oh, look, it looks like we can get a pint here, Carl. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, like you see, we made it to the cricket club now, and we'll see when the fireworks are going to go off. Yeah, take care. So, can I have a look about, see what's going on? Sparklers. You got a hog roast here. Oh, not that. It looks as good as it smells. <laughs> Proper hog on that one there. Pretty cool. Do you reckon he's got enough candy floss? Or what? I think he needs another bag. Hey, I think that kid needs another bag of candy floss. Yes, it is. Thank you. So it's got this is the cricket club. Right, yeah, we just found out it's 8 o'clock the time the fireworks are going off. But now it's just half past six, so we're off it heading somewhere else now. Uh, basically, got to drop Carl off and go to, to a few other places. But yeah, I'm glad we didn't pay six pounds getting here. Are you glad, Carl? Oh, definitely. We don't pay. No. <laughs> we just have them all. Exactly. <laughs> you know how the uh, Urbexes do it. <laughs> yeah, I might as well go out the front gate. Yeah. Oops, flick it round. Go up these stairs here. You got the nice lights to show us all the way out. Didn't have these on the way in? No, they didn't have them on the bushes <laughs> where we came in, did they? <laughs> yeah, do you reckon if we ask for our money back, they'll give it us? Yeah. No. See, we didn't know it was supposed to be 8 o'clock. <laughs> yeah, so I'll just leave it recording as we go past the guards or the <laughs> office people or whatever you call it, ticket men. Yeah, look, someone's arguing now. Yeah. We'll give us some advice. <laughs> yeah, alright. Yeah, yeah, enough. Uh, not staying till eight o'clock for the fireworks. Right. Uh, yeah. No, oh, oh, shame that. Right. Yeah. Sorry to hear that. No refunds to take it. Unfortunately, yeah. Hope you're feeling better soon. All right. Nice one, boss. See you later. Oh, Yeah. Well, I know we didn't uh, 
pay to go in. But there's no harm in asking for a refund, is there? <laughs> so let's get back to the car and get out of here. Hey, look. Even the bar, cow. The bar made me be able to see us getting in and out of the bar house post. Yeah, look, you've got staff walking about as well there. Collecting uh, oh, yeah. glasses and stuff. Yeah. There's no focus out there, is it? Well, all the lights over here, yeah. yeah. 